Hey guys, um, so this is my first YouTube channel, and I'm going to be doing this video on an eyebrow tutorial. So basically, what I use is this Anastasia number 12 brush. Well then, and of course, the dip brow by Anastasia as well. My color is dark brown, by the way. So basically... I'm pretty sure we all know what it looks like. Um, yeah, it looks like this. Mine isn't that old, but yeah. So basically, I just dip it front and back. And depending on the style of brows that I want, um, yeah, depending on like the style that I want or the style that I'm going for, um, it varies like how thick or thin I want my eyebrows to be. So I'm gonna be using this um, mirror. Yeah, so basically, I like to outline them. So today, I'm just going for, like, my basic everyday um, eyebrow look. So basically, I outline it starting from... Okay, so, like, the front of my eyebrow isn't really dark. However, like, the end is dark. So I start from where my, my hair is start getting dark. And I basically just outline it. It's kind of dry, because and left it open when I lent it to her so yeah I just outlined them and if you find it easier to use the Anastasia brow pencil to outline it go for it but I feel like this is too thin to just like I feel like you'll waste it easier so I use this only to fill in like parts that I missed so yeah then for the top, you're going to start at the top of where you started as well. Okay, so I'm going for like that thickness or however you'd like to say it. And then basically I just start filling it in. And that isn't going to stay like that. No, 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 no. That's where the blending comes in. So you don't have to use this exact brush. You can, look, I have another brush actually. I have this brush and it works okay. I mean, you basically just need an angled brush see? and it doesn't have the spoolie, but you actually need one. So if you're gonna use one that doesn't have a spoolie, you can get one of these. You can get one from Sephora or Mac, like one of those um, test testing ones so yeah just basically just fill it in okay I'll be right back okay so once you're done fill filling it in okay so you see how right here I have like a little patch so that's when this comes in so basically I just go in and I just fill in that little spot this is optional you don't have to do this and so then for this part, oh, this one comes with a spoolie as well, but I'm not going to use this spoolie, I'm going to use this one because it's much rougher. So basically what I like to do is I like to brush them the opposite way so you get that little fade in the front. So yeah, basically what I do. somewhat getting there and you can add on product as well if you like um personally I don't like that harsh line that goes like on the bottom of your eyebrow I, I don't like that so I kind of just I kind of just get more product and I slowly bring it more closer to the front and then I blend it this way the opposite way <laughs> Yeah, so I'll get back to you when I'm done doing that. Okay, so I just finished blending it how I like it to be. So now, you're gonna get your concealer, which I forgot to get. But anyways, I recommend using a flat brush. You can use, I'll be right back. I, I know some people like using like one of these brushes that's round, but for me, personally, I prefer a flat brush. Basically, like one of these brushes that is flat. 
So basically, you're gonna get your concealer. I'm gonna use, be using this MAC concealer. So basically, I just dab it, and then you follow the line that your eyebrow goes to, and it's basically just gonna cut your eyebrow to make it look sharp. So I like starting from the front. And you just follow the line of where you want your eyebrow to be at. When I had went to get this at MAC, the lady told me to get the lighter shade that was at MAC. And I feel like I should have listened because this one kind of looks a little bit orange on me. But of course you're not going to have this exact same one that I have so I'm pretty sure you're used to the one that you have so you just get your concealer and just outline your eyebrow so I'm gonna be adding a little bit more for the tip because it's not really as sharp as I want it to be so you just get a little bit more product and you just splice your eyebrow And then you're, you're going to be doing the same on the top. I have other concealers. However, the one that I usually use, um, they don't make it anymore. Well, last time I checked, they said that it was discontinued. But it was, a, it was an Anastasia concealer. So, like, the tip was one side was a concealer and the other side is, like, the highlight. But yeah, they said that it was discontinued because I was going to get a new one because it worked really good. So yeah, back to what I was saying. So after you do the bottom, you're going to do the exact same thing on the top. And also another reason why I like this one is because it's really like moist. And this one, I'm not going to lie, it's kind of, kind of rough. So then you're going to do the exact same thing on the top. like so if you don't want if you didn't want to like do it from the from like the very front you could you could just do it from like the middle if you want so you see it's kind of coming together i really like like a pointy sharp tip now the hard part is going to be to blend this out because like i said it was kind of a little too yellow for me but it's okay we'll make it work That's what we have so far. Hmm. So as I'm looking at it, I see a like little like a little spot right here. And when I use this I use like a very light hand because like I don't want to break it because it's really thin actually it's really thin i don't know if you can see it but yeah this is really thin and i wouldn't want it to break so then after that i use my brow gel from anastasia as well and i think this is just a dark brown gel you don't have to use a tinted brow gel you can use any eyebrow gel if you want. And this is basically just to set your eyebrows like so and then I guess that's your finished look and then if you'd like you can put highlight 
on the top of your brow, like most people like doing. So I'm just gonna use this brush because it's pretty flat. So basically, you're just gonna just tap a little bit. to get your eyebrow glowing a little bit so yes I also have the Anastasia Glow Kit as well which I highly highly recommend this is my favorite yes so yeah I'm gonna use this one as well and I use summer. See? You really get that nice, that really nice highlight right there. And if you'd like, you can just go back in and fix any minor details you have. So this is my finished look. You see, it went from no eyebrows to this eyebrow so of course this is gonna be a learning process for me um you know um I don't even know if I said my name my name is Hannah Gonzalez um I am a junior at Wilson um I'm in a police academy and I am currently 16 years old 16 years old so yeah back to what I was saying um, yeah, this is going to be a learning process, you know, I've been wanting to make a YouTube channel for a long time, I just really wasn't, like, confident enough to, like, just the thought of, like, just recording myself and uploading it for, like, everybody to see, you know, but, yeah, um, I'm learning, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, um, and I hope you guys liked it. That was the second time my sisters walked in my room. So, yeah. Um, make sure you guys like and subscribe this video. That's if I decide to post it. But, yeah. Hope to see you guys again in another tutorial. Um, yeah, I feel like this, what I'm saying is like really basic, you know, because everybody says that but it's okay you know i'm learning i'm learning <laughs> bye